Well, here, uh, COVID-19 craziness, I know. Uh, uncertainties everywhere, so it's kind of some things that I do. I'm still going into the Trek Bicycle Headquarters in Waterloo there. Um, a lot of precautionary measures being taken there by the staff. That's freaking awesome. Uh, so I'm gonna kind of do, show you what I do, just to kind of some just some safety measures. We go grocery shopping. We get to go food. We got all this kind of stuff going on. So just some things that the squirrel does, just to make sure that he's keeping his family safe. Um, I got a little 17 month old. Like I said, you'll see cameos of her if you haven't seen it already. Um, but in all seriousness, this is just some fun stuff that I do to make sure we're safe. I do not wear my clothes back once I go to trek. I kind of take them off in the garage and, and make sure that those are either aired out for two days or washed right away. Um, I don't bring my shoes in the house. I wash my hands frequently. The key to washing your hands too, I know this sounds really stupid, hot water as hot as you can handle, 30 seconds scrubbing back and forth, kind of getting under your nails. Shouldn't even be wearing this wedding band right now, but we're at home, so we're, we're gonna let it fly. Um, We'll be washing our hands a lot in here, but just to keep the video rolling, I'm not gonna wash my hands every time. We'll just kind of talk about it. These things are all safe. They've all been just kind of staged, uh, just to kind of show you what I do, okay? Uh, I go grocery shopping all the time. I try to keep the social distance. I do not want to spread. I want to help level off that curve too. Uh, I know that we can all do our little parts. So this is just something, when I do go grocery shopping, I wear gloves, I sanitize the cart. I kind of take it all seriously. Uh, there's been a lot of information inundating everybody, so you can go online and go crazy if you want, but these are just some fun things to go. Brought home my awesome bag, set it there. Hands are dirty now. Dirty side, clean side. Okay. Um, this is my disinfectant. I make up a solution. You can buy the wipes if you can find them, uh, however you want to do it. I saturate a towel, boom. And I'm literally going to take everything out of this bag and set it on my dirty side. Okay? All right, I'm going to discard that bag. That is gone. Pretend you didn't see this. This was in the bag. I know it's not in the bag, but it was in the bag for all intents and purposes. Okay. Boom. So there we go. There's our stuff we went grocery shopping for. We now want to sanitize it. Dirty side, clean side. If you give ourselves a good spray down on here. We got sanitizer now on here. You need to sanitize your hands up now. Make sure clothes are sanitized. You can kind of get a good wipe. This can be wet. This is not going to ruin the outside of the bag. Don't worry about that. Get all those germs from that stock or whoever may have touched that off there. Boom, clean side. Same as peanut butter. Who knows when they stocked it? Get it off there. Boom. Got your awesome fake milk. Boom. Got your breakfast cereal. You got Bob kicking here. Get him all wiped down, who knows who's tainted him. Veggies, what do we do with veggies now? We're not gonna spray those and sanitize because that's gonna taste like crap. We're not gonna sit there and scrub it under hot water because that's gonna tain them too. We're gonna take our awesome veggies. We're gonna throw them in a little bit of soapy cold water. Cold water so we don't mess them up there. We're gonna use Dawn. Dawn's good, right? Why is Dawn good, huh? It's safe enough for little chickies with oil coming off. It's safe enough for us. All right, I use Dawn. We're literally just gonna plop those suckers in there. Clean hands, I've been sanitizing them over here. Get yourself a nice towel, let's set them out and dry. And literally just run them in there. Scrub them off, get all that stuff off. I know you guys are all wondering what happened to the squirrel, right? Did the cheese shift off his cracker? My wife would say slightly, that's fine, that's fine. I'd rather look back and say, hey, you know what? I took some extra steps, but I'm okay. Judge me if you will. All right, so that's what I do. I kind of give everything a good washing. Let it air dry, let it sit out for a couple hours before you put it back in the pantry. Hands are washed, I'm gonna go ahead and give a wash again. Boom. Turn it back over to the hot. Scrub the base, going around. Not gonna waste too much time. This is TV magic, don't forget. Okay, now we got to go food. Okay, judge your place where you go. Watch what they do. If you got some 16 year old kid wiping his face because he's running around outside carrying these to go orders of people, got some gloves he hasn't changed in like 10 years, snotted up, he's wiping his face, he's wiping his top of his eye, head, he's running back out there. Don't go back there, okay? All right, to go food, boom. I don't do a whole lot of to go food. I cook a lot at home. Get quarantined with the chef, that's the trick. Huh? Huh? 
quarantine 15? No, it's quarantine 50 in this house. We're packing them on, we're having fun. Okay, so for all intents and purposes, I don't, like I said, do over to-go food a lot. So we had to kind of make up some to-go food here. Um, make sure you have a clean plate, clean side, clean plate. Take out your to-go food. You can use gloves at this point, or as you unwrap it, your hands are gonna become tainted. Go back to the dish, wash your hands when you're all done. We're gonna use gloves, kind of show you all the different ways we can do this. And I might even just do one glove on. This hand's held safe now. This is a tainted hand. I'm gonna hold the bag. I'm gonna get out my awesome, trying not to touch everything, and now they're both tainted hands. Oh, well. So pretend these are fries, these are actually Sharpies. It's a work casualty, okay? I use a lot of Sharpies, some come home. Just saying. All right, discard of your wrapper immediately. Who knows when that 16 year old punk kid handled those and did your wrapper, get that off there. Same with your hamburger here, or if you will, energy balls, huh? Who's missing those, right? Freaking delicious. Left a little ball residue in my bag though, not good. Tainted bag, boom. Take off gloves, tainted hands, now wash, jump. 30 seconds, rinse, wash, back to normal. Simple steps, okay? It's a virus, if it's gonna spread, it's gonna be on what they use to package it. If the food is hot enough above 180, it's gonna kill that stuff. If you're really super worried about it and you just don't know, mic it, man. What can you do? You're just gonna heat it up and kill whatever could be on there. Just some simple safety tips from the squirrel, because I care, because I miss my Trek peeps, and I want y'all coming back, all right? Keep up with these videos, there's more to come.